Europe's rich history is etched into the walls of its many castles, with tales of battles, royalty, and revolutions echoing through their halls. However, some of these historic fortresses are renowned not just for their past, but for the legends of the supernatural that have taken root in their ancient stones. Perfect for the haunted castle segment. A haunted castle in Europe is often characterized by its historical significance and the lore surrounding eerie occurrences within its walls. From unexplained sounds and ghost sightings to tales of tragic events, these castles serve as a nexus between the tangible past and the mysteries of the supernatural. This is a castle, isn't it? There are tapestries. Eileen Donan Castle. Eileen Donan Castle, located on a small tidal island at the point where three great sea locks meet in the western highlands of Scotland, is a 13th century fortress. The castle was initially established as a defense against Viking incursions and played a significant role in the Jacobite uprisings. It was destroyed in 1719 but was lovingly restored in the early 20th century to its former medieval splendor, becoming one of Scotland's most iconic landmarks. The castle is purportedly haunted by a soldier who was killed during the Spanish support of the Jacobite cause. Visitors and staff have reported seeing a ghostly figure in full armor, and there are tales of mysterious footsteps and echoes of a long-finished war that resonate through the empty chambers. Bran Castle 30th May, Castle Dracula Bran Castle, often associated with the legend of Dracula, is perched on the border between Transylvania and Wallachia in Romania. Originally built in the 14th century, it served as protection against the Ottoman Empire and later became a customs post on the mountain pass between the provinces. Its connection to Vlad the Impaler, who inspired Bram Stoker's vampire, is tenuous, but has made the castle a magnet for lore enthusiasts. Despite its Dracula association, the real ghost stories of Bran Castle are less known. Some visitors speak of a disquieting atmosphere and a feeling of being watched. The occasional sighting of a former queen's spirit wandering the castle grounds adds a layer of haunting elegance to this historic site. Windsor Castle. Can you guarantee the safety of HRH? Sir, she's as safe here as in Windsor Castle. Windsor Castle is a royal residence at Windsor in the English county of Berkshire. It is notable for its long association with the English and later British royal family and for its architecture. The original castle was built in the 11th century after the Norman invasion by William the Conqueror. Since the time of Henry I, it has been used by succeeding monarchs, making it the longest occupied palace in Europe. Among the many ghosts said to haunt Windsor Castle, perhaps the most famous is that of King Henry VIII, whose footsteps are claimed to be heard in the dead of night, along with his agonizing groans. Queen Elizabeth I is also reported to make appearances in the Royal Library, still keeping an eye on the kingdom she once ruled. Edinburgh Castle Edinburgh Castle dominates Scotland's capital city from its position atop Castle Rock. It has been a royal castle since the reign of David I in the 12th century and has been at the center of numerous historical conflicts, including the wars of Scottish independence in the 14th century and the Jacobite Rising of 1745. The castle is said to be one of the most haunted spots in Scotland, with reports of apparitions ranging from a piper who disappeared in the tunnels below the castle to the spirits of French prisoners from the Seven Years' War and colonial prisoners from the American Revolutionary War. The castle's dungeons are a focal point for tales of ghostly sightings and unexplained phenomena. I see a castle of silver and gold. Dunagore Castle. Dunagore Castle is a round 16th century tower house with a small walled enclosure located near the coastal village of Doolan in County Clare, Ireland. It was restored in the 1970s and serves as a private holiday home. Its history is less documented than other castles, but it was involved in the tumult of the Irish struggles including the 1588 shipwreck of the Spanish Armada. Local lore suggests that the castle is haunted by the spirits of those who perished when a ship of the Spanish Armada was wrecked nearby. The ghosts of the drowned sailors are said to roam the cliffs and the castle, forever bound to the site of their untimely demise. Tower of London. No, my lord. The palace dogs. The Tower of London. The Tower of London's history is as complex as it is long. Founded towards the end of 1066 as part of the Norman conquest of England, the White Tower, which gives the entire castle its name, was built by William the Conqueror in 1078. It served variously as a royal residence, mint, treasury, and most infamously as a prison. The tower has been a witness to key historical events, 
including the execution of Anne Boleyn, the imprisonment of Elizabeth I before she became queen, and the mysterious disappearance of the princes in the Tower. The Tower of London is reputedly the most haunted building in Britain. Among its spectral residents is the ghost of Anne Boleyn, who was beheaded in 1536 on the orders of her husband, Henry VIII. Her headless body has been seen walking the tower's corridors and sometimes near the spot of her execution. Other reported ghosts include Lady Jane Grey, Sir Walter Raleigh, and the princes in the tower, who were believed to have been murdered by their uncle, Richard III. Niedzika Castle Niedzika Castle, also known as Dunajek Castle, is located in the southernmost part of Poland. It was constructed between the 13th and 14th centuries in a Gothic style and served as an important center for trade and defense over the centuries. The castle stands as a testament to the various cultural influences, including Hungarian and Slovak, that have shaped the region. The legend of Niedzika Castle revolves around the Inca princess, Umina, who was supposedly murdered along with her child and is said to haunt the castle grounds. The tale tells of a hidden treasure and a curse upon those who seek it, adding an aura of mystery and an unsettling feeling to the already atmospheric castle. Musham Castle Located in the province of Salzburg, Austria, Musham Castle has origins dating back to the 13th century. It gained notoriety in the late 17th and early 18th centuries as the administrative center for the Salzburg Witch Trials, where hundreds of people were accused of witchcraft and many were executed. Some were also executed for being found guilty of being werewolves. Young wizards and witches sometimes try to suppress their magic to avoid persecution. Given its gruesome history with the witch trials, Musham Castle is said to be haunted by the tortured souls of those who were executed within its walls. Unexplained sounds, sightings of shadowy figures, and a general ominous atmosphere are a testament to its dark past. Donaustauf Castle Donaustauf Castle sits in ruins above the town of Donaustauf, near Regensburg in Bavaria, Germany. The castle dates back to the early 10th century and was destroyed in the Napoleonic Wars. Although it was partially reconstructed in the 19th century, it remains a ruin, offering panoramic views of the Danube River and the Walhalla Memorial. The ruins of Donostov Castle are said to be haunted by the spirits of knights who once served the Holy Roman Empire. Phantom lights moving through the ruins at night and the spectral sound of clashing swords have been reported, fueling the mystique that surrounds this once grand castle. The tales of hauntings in these European castles often stem from their violent and tumultuous histories. Wars, executions, and untimely deaths seem to leave a spiritual residue that fuels ghost stories and legends. Whether or not one believes in ghosts, these stories serve an important cultural purpose by preserving history and stimulating the imagination providing a narrative that often reflects the collective psyche of the time and place. Europe's haunted castles are more than mere tourist attractions. They are custodians of history and folklore. They provide a unique window into the past, allowing us to explore the confluence of historical fact and supernatural fiction. Whether one visits for the architecture, the history, or the thrill of possibly encountering a ghost, these castles offer a rich and enduring experience that transcends the boundary between the living and the spectral realms. Each of these castles, with their unique stories and ghostly legends, not only provides a glimpse into the past, but also offers an opportunity for visitors to ponder the mysteries that have yet to be explained. Whether or not one believes in the supernatural, the allure of haunted castles lies in their ability to connect us to history in a way that feels immediate and visceral where every stone might hold a story and every shadow could hide a ghost from centuries past.